Good afternoon, everyone. It's a pleasure to be gathered here in Toronto alongside some of my cabinet colleagues to participate in a long-term investment summit organized in collaboration with BlackRock. For those who aren't familiar, BlackRock is a New York-based asset management corporation investing trillions of dollars on behalf of clients around the world. And some of their key partners are here today to talk about investing in Canada. Now, that shouldn't come as a surprise to anyone. Canada has long stood tall on the world stage. And over the past year, we've been a proud champion for inclusion and integration within our broader global community. We've welcomed skilled immigrants and refugees to our towns and cities, broken down trade barriers, and engaged in progressive international diplomacy. Canada has long been and continues to be an island of stability for investors. And investment in Canada and in Canadian workers is a smart, pragmatic choice. C'est un endroit idéal pour faire des affaires pour plusieurs raisons. Le Canada est le PIB qui connaît la croissance la plus rapide et les coûts d'entreprise les plus bas du G7. Nous avons des marchés de capitaux efficaces et l'un des systèmes bancaires les plus sécuritaires du monde. Et nous avons des règles claires et prévisibles en ce qui a trait à l'investissement étranger. Mais ce n'est pas tout. Le Canada bénéficie d'un accès privilégié à l'économie mondiale ayant conclu des traités de libre-échange avec plusieurs pays. Comme vous le savez, nous venons tout juste de signer l'accord de libre-échange Canada-Union européenne, ce qui nous donnera un accès sans précédent au marché des États membres de l'Union européenne. De plus, la main-d'œuvre canadienne est diversifiée, innovatrice et l'une des plus scolarisées au monde. Et nous sommes reconnus à travers le monde comme des leaders dans plusieurs domaines, notamment la technologie propre, l'énergie, le transport, les sciences de la vie, le secteur créatif, l'intelligence artificielle et la physique quantum. So today, we're talking with these global investors about win-win propositions that will support Canadian innovation and large-scale infrastructure projects. We're giving them a broader idea of the Canadian vision for growth, where we currently stand as a nation, where we ultimately want to go, and what it's going to take to get us there. Since forming government, my team has made it a priority to develop strong relationships with political and business leaders on the international stage. And we've done this because we know that in order to create good jobs, grow the economy, and strengthen the middle class, the private and public sectors must work together as partners. So today, we welcome global investors and BlackRock to Toronto. And we look forward to continuing our discussions on the unparalleled benefits of investing in Canada and in the people who call it home. 